so for us to be disciplined for us to stay away from distractions for us to be uh, away from lethargy okay some of the most successful people have been incorporating rituals and rhythms into their life okay like you know when they get up they know what is the next thing to do yes. they are not going to let anything else distract them yes. you know 1 2 3 4 5 this is what i do next this is what i do next this is what i do next they have a very clear priority chart yes because they have that it gets so much etched into their mind and being spiritual i think we should have our own rhythm in life okay. in the sense okay the first thing that when i get up the first thing i'm going to do is kneel down and pray and thank the lord for keeping me safe through the night wow. for helping me wake up with health without pain yes in the morning yes commit the day into god's hands invoke the presence of god and awaken the anointing on the inside of you also bind anything that could come your way come anything that comes against ask the lord not to lead us into temptation Amen. ask for daily bread and provision yes. and ask the lord to deliver us from the evil one and give him all the glory you know that as much as you want to rush to the washroom you are not going to do that till you get up from your knee for maybe 30 seconds maybe 60 seconds maybe a minute but right after that you know okay the next thing is this is my second this is my third this is my fourth thing that i'm going to do in the morning so that's your rhythm that's a rhythm that's a rhythm that you have to get it will help you from lethargy it will help you from distractions but it's not a decision that i take that by my efforts i'm going to do it and say lord please help me anoint me so that i'll be sick. anointing is not just to cast out demons anointing is not just to preach anointing is to have a victorious daily life amen well wow.